Alrighty folks, welcome to stormtopia.com, daily forecast video here with Nick Sayer. Here's the current infrared satellite imagery. You can see we have some activity in the southeast, some activity on the west. They're going to converge. We're going to see some snow. Let's do, take a look at the forecast memo right now. Lame snowfall expected uh, late Wednesday night into early Thursday morning. Highest totals in the central Appalachians. You can expect 2 to 4 inches. And the cutoff is going to be in southern New England. I think Boston sees nothing out of this. Maybe coastal cities such as Bridgeport, Newport, Rhode Island might see decoding. And uh, Friday looks quiet. Let's talk about uh, basically Wednesday's forecast. First of all here, we're going to be seeing uh, light snow pushing in, which changes from light snow possible to light snow expected because we are going to see, I'm pretty confident on my forecast, and it basically moves into these areas during the afternoon. Over the night it's in here, and it's gone by Friday morning up in here. Oh, excuse me, Thursday morning. Here's how much snow you can actually expect from this whole event. A dust to two inches, and I'm going to zoom you on into some of the most critical areas. Starting off here in southern New England, basically, again, coastal southern New England, all the way back up to about Providence. You're probably looking at a rounded coating. New York, um, most um, uh, upper, uh, most part of the upper mid-Atlantic, probably a dusting to two inches. D.C., Baltimore, probably a dusting to two inches for you guys. Two to three inches is possible out further to the west in places like Cumberland, Maryland. Two to four inches for places like Snowshoe, all the way back up into south central Pennsylvania. Pittsburgh is where you see a little bit less snow, probably around a coating to an inch or two. In Pittsburgh, and a coating to an inch or two or less south to the to the south and west. And in terms of beyond that, let's take a way out to Thursday. Storm should be gone pretty quickly. Friday gone pretty quickly. Now this is an image posted on my Facebook page. You'd be very smart to be a member of our Facebook page. It's free, no hassle. Uh, this is what AccuWeather is uh, potentially saying one scenario could be for Saturday night. This is interesting stuff. And uh, what they're basically talking about is blossoming snow as a low pressure center rapidly intensifies pushing off of New England. And you know there is one forecast model one forecast model that us forecasters have access to, and I guess anyone has access to. Shouldn't make it sound so amazing. European model. I don't know why it's not on here right now, but it shouldn't be a major issue. And it did show a similar solution. Here we are by, and this is basically late Saturday night. So here we are by Friday morning. There's act. If you're gonna do that blue screen thing again, I'm gonna have to get a new computer because I literally can't stand that anymore. We're looking at activity brewing in the south by Friday morning. It's ready to head back up into this direction. That's pretty much what it does. It hooks up with some energy, and voila, we got another couple inches in this area. And it's not really quite intense enough. You see a little bit of heavier snow in eastern New England, but it's not as intense as AccuWeather says it could be. Could. This is just potential. And again, this is over 96 hours out. This has got plenty of time to transpire. There's plenty of things that can change, and there's, I'm sure, plenty of things that will change. But that's it for now. Have a good day.